Hi guys and welcome back to another video. I know it's been a while since we filmed, hasn't it? I know. Anyway, so we get a lot of requests to do a natural, beginner friendly everyday makeup and this is what we did. It looks a little bit intense because of the eyeliner, but I personally prefer a dramatic eyeliner over a natural eyeliner. But that's the only difference. If not, it's pretty natural and easy to achieve as you can see in the minute and if you guys would like to see more tutorials like this I'm in the suggestion in the description box below and i will see you in my next video all right guys so to start up today we are going to be using our concealer the one i use to cover my brows so just a very natural tone and just prime my eyelids with it so i'm not going to be using a white eyeshadow white eye base sorry since that can be pretty scary for like you know beginner friendly if you just start out with makeup so yeah I'm gonna use my face brush to blend that out. So I'm just gonna tap that in. Now that we have that blender, you can use your face powder, translucent powder, any kind of powder you want basically. But since I have my wet powder closest to me, I'm gonna use that. But it wouldn't really make much of a difference. And just press that in. Now that I have my lid primed and set I'm just gonna go with my first color which is gonna be this orange right here with like a red undertone and I'll walk that into my crease oh and it, this is the Miss Rose yeah Miss Rose palette and I'll just walk that into my crease so I'm just gonna put that color in until I get to a level of intensity that I like so how rich I want the color to be and for my next shade, I'm going to go in with my Saffron Face Powder in Hot Fudge. It's like a really nice brown, like a really rich brown. Kind of like Cocoa Beaver Makeup Cake, except it's a bit more or darker, I guess. And I'll put that in my crease directly, just to build it up. I'm going to go back in with a little bit of my first color. Alright, now I'm going to be using my Stargazer eyeshadow in Deep Red and I'll put it directly in my crease as well and in the outer corner. Alright, now I'm going to use my white eyeshadow and this really beige it's almost like white but it's not white and I'll put that in the outer half of my or inner half of my eyes so just pat that on I'm not going to use the white eyeshadow over it just so it just can really open up my eyes make it brighter Now that I put my wet on, I'm gonna go with my brushes and just blend around the edges just to make it a little bit neater. I'm just gonna go back in with this with the brush. I'm not really adding any more product just to bring back some lightness into the eyes that's pretty much it but I want to add some depth so I just this is going to be the last color use this brown just a chocolatey color and put it just right at the outer corner you will barely tell I even have any brown on so I'm just going to tap that in very lightly and I'm just keeping that on the outer corner for my eyeliner I'm actually going to use an, uh, an eyeshadow which is my midnight eyeshadow by MUA, as you can see, this was like legit go to eyeliner every day. So, I'm gonna mix that with my Inglot Draw Line to make an eyeliner. So, just gonna do a simple wing eyeliner today. I 
last is our own i'm just gonna clean up now we're gonna move on to foundation and i am gonna be filming my foundation routine very soon but again as always the products will be in the description box below <laughs> oh lord i know i felt that boxing till like one week later yeah but this time i'll do it okay like the day or the day after promise it's everyday makeup look but you know we still want to look glam I didn't prime. Let's prime quickly. I'm now going to do my under eye and I'll do the same as I did with my eyelid. So my red shade first, not red, sorry, the orange shade first. And I'll go with the hot fudge and then red. Go with that same gel, not a gel liner, eyeliner. I'm putting in my water liner as well. Take my snow gold highlight and put it in my chair dot. I usually wear this eye shadow. I usually wear it with a pair with a brown lip pencil or with a blue eyeshadow, just like the one as my eyeliner. But today we're gonna go with this brown lip pencil all right guys so this is pretty much it for the tutorial and i hope you enjoyed it and if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe and leave any suggestion in the description box below and i will see you in my next video